Hello, I'm Kim Campbell. I'm your Trig Instructor and I wanted to just show you really briefly what I expect to see when you do your room scan video for your test. Now, first thing, remember to move your uh, webcam or your computer slowly so that it doesn't blur. When you do the room scan, I need to see the complete room. I'm lucky I've got a chair that turns so I can turn and show the entire room and be able to do it fairly smoothly and slowly. You can see that there is no one else in the room with me. That's the purpose of the room scan. The other purpose is to show that there is only one monitor screen available. So this right here, where I have my computer monitor screen within reach, that is not okay. Um, I would get a zero on my test. Make sure that you don't have any other monitor screens available, even if they're turned off. Um, if you can't physically move it and set it on the floor, then tilt it down, lay it down so that it would be a production for you to have to gain access to it again to make sure that I don't have to worry about you doing that at some point during your test. It cannot be as simple as you turning on another screen. The other thing that you need to do is show me that there is nothing under the desk. If you're sitting at a desk, if you're on a bed, you need to show me that there is nothing hidden in blankets or anywhere else. And you need to show me your work surface. This would be my work surface. The only thing that I have are pens and pencils as well as some blank paper and my, um, my calculator. You're gonna need to show me every sheet of blank paper and prove to me that it's blank. So you need to be able to flip through all the sheets of paper just like that. That means no notebook. If you have a whole notebook, there's no way to show me that the entire notebook is blank. You also need to be able to show me your calculator. I need to see that it's a scientific calculator. If your calculator has a lid or cover, you need to pull that apart to show me that you do not have any notes here as well. Basically, I need to know you're not trying to cheat. I need to be able to be as certain as I possibly can that you're in a testing environment just like if you were at the testing center. That means no other people, no other screens, no notes available to you. Um, it means that you don't need to be eating, a uh, drink, having some water handy nearby is fine. Um, having your furry friend in the room is fine. I love to see your pet cats and dogs. But otherwise, you need to be in a testing situation. Uh, also, make sure that when you hold up your ID that I can see your ID photo and read your name. Uh, I need to be able to clearly identify you. Make sure that you retake that picture if that is not the case. Thank you very much.